There are many videos about making a security camera in this channel, all of which I made with the help of the ESP32 camera module. Some of those projects send the images on an internet server, which removes the geographical restriction. But now I've received a damaged security camera that I want to make operational again. So please stay with me until the end of the video. This video is sponsored by PCBWay. More on them later. The ESP32 camera module has an onboard antenna, which is very suitable for short distances. In addition, it has a connector for connecting an external antenna, which cannot be used normally. For this, you need to change the resistance on the module from this state to this state. I did this, and with the help of this connector, I connect a GSM antenna to the module. To program the module, you need a USB to TTL converter, which I explained earlier. If you refer to videos in the description section, it will help you. There are two methods for programming. One of them is to use the program provided by this website, which removes the geographical restriction. And the other method is to use the default program of Arduino IDE, which I prefer because it has many settings and options that enhance the ambient light and is the good option for dark environments. The front panel of my camera has an LDR sensor and an infrared light, which I plan to have both operational. For this purpose, I designed a comparator circuit that... Let, let, let's test it. Now the comparator circuit works in such a way that when there is light, the infrared is off, but it turns on in the dark. So far we've gone very well, but before continuing, I must say, this video is sponsored by PCBWay. PCBWay is your one-stop solution for your projects. Wherever there is talk of electronic projects, you will see PCBWay services. They offer custom PCB prototype service, CNC machining, 3D printing, injection molding, sheet metal fabrication, and more. You can order your projects online and they ship worldwide within 24 hours. Check them out at pcbway.com
All right, guys, thank you so much for being with me so far. These videos are related to uh, this module. You can go and watch them. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. Be sure to leave your comments. At the end, I would like to say that uh, I had to make some changes in the camera circuit, but I finally installed it uh, and it's working now. Uh, thank you again for watching the video. Uh, goodbye. See you soon.